Hundreds of people gathered today for the dedication of the Pioneers of 1847 Monument. The monument honors African-American pioneers and their role in the Mormon migration and Utah settlement. New specialist Kara Bracken now with more on this new place to educate, learn, and reflect. This monument is also going to serve as a place of healing to honor those pioneers that paved a way that was not easy, as well as a place of celebration for where we are today. The Pioneers of 1847 Monument honors pioneers Green Flake, Hark Wells, Oscar Smith, and Jane Manning James. Their stories are engraved in local stone from the Browns Canyon Quarry. A variety of leaders, including Governor Cox, President Ballard, Quorum of the Twelve Apostles, Ellis Ivory with This Is the Place Foundation, and Betty Sawyer with Ogden's NAACP spoke at the monument dedication. Monument coordinator Mally Jr. Bonner also spoke today, speechless for a moment, describing the monument as a story to show how far we've come and the journey we still have to go. Many suffered, many died, and we don't tell their stories to make the Missourians who forced them onto this trek feel bad or shame them. We don't, that's not why we tell it. We tell it because these pioneers endured something incredible. I should also note the monument was delivered just two days ago, so right on time as we enter Pioneer Day weekend. For now, reporting in Salt Lake City, I'm Kara Bracken for KSL 5 News. Oh, what a great new space. Uh, Kara, thank you. A traffic note, everybody. Days of 47 Parade kicks off tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. We can't wait, uh, but it means the major road closures and delays in downtown Salt Lake City will be in effect. So uh, it begins on State Street and South Temple, ends on 600 East at Liberty Park. Same route as always, typically. Uh, keep in mind, there are a couple of races happening at the same time, uh, full length of a marathon, too. If you are headed to these events, pack plenty of patience along with the umbrellas and the chairs and be ready for some fun. And of course, if you'd rather watch from the cool comfort of your own couch, KSL has got you covered. Catch all the action right here tomorrow morning. Not only will you get the best views of all the floats, but you also have a chance to win a thousand bucks. All you got to do is watch for the keywords and enter them on our Facebook page. That winner will be announced Saturday night. So good luck. Yeah, good luck, everybody.